Well, our topic today is nitrogen cycle. We are all known that nitrogen is very essential for us. Being living beings in our cells, in our tissues, nitrogen is present abundantly. But we cannot synthesize nitrogen on our own. The inorganic nitrogen are not synthesized. That is why we need to take the nitrogen in the in or organic form, like in the form of diet, protein diets, nitrogen at into. So here we are looking about how are the nitrogen, how does the nitrogen cycle take place, how the nitrogen in the atmosphere get recycled and how we, uh, we get the nitrogen from the atmosphere. And we all know that there is nitrogen gas is present all over the atmosphere. So how does the nitrogen get uh, fixed? Nitrogen get fixed because it, nitrogen, we cannot intake nitrogen. As we intake oxygen, we cannot intake nitrogen. So how do we take the nitrogen? Nitrogen present is in the N2 form in the atmosphere. There are four ways by which the nitrogen may be fixed biologically or synthetically as well. The uh, first one is mentioned in this topic here. It is okay. Number one industrial fixation. Industrial fixation are also known as Haber's Bose process in which we apply heavy temperature, heavy pressure and we, tr we fix the atmospheric nitrogen into ammonia. Second one is given is symbiosis. Symbiosis, symbiosis is the process in which two organisms are interrelated like in case of leguminous plants. In case of leguminous plants there are Certain bacteria, nitrogenous containing bacteria like rhizobium, cyanobacteria, cyanobacteria, multiple organisms are present in the roots and they synthesize, fix the atmospheric nitrogen and provide to the plants. In other way, the plants provide them the sufficient nutrients. So there is a symbiotic relationship helping each other relationship and nitrogen fixation takes place. So this nitrogen are form are converted into the soluble form by the symbiotic organism and the plants take it because plants cannot take the atmospheric nitrogen directly. The other is Agetobacter or Clostridium. In this the organisms are not in, in, although they don't get a symbiotic benefit still these organisms like Agetobacter or Clostridium they help in fixing the atmospheric nitrogen so they are torn into the soluble nitrous form that can be easily uptaken by the plants while uptaking the water with them. And finally, natural natural process that is for lightning, when there is heavy lightning in the atmosphere, and provides the energy and pressure sufficient to fix the atmospheric nitrogen because uh, there is always nitrogen and oxygen present in the universe. In case of lightning, nitrogen and oxygen fades together to form nitrate, nitrite, and other compounds. But as we all see, we are talking about a cycle, so if the step doesn't end here, we have all from the nitrate cycle, it may form ammonia, it may form nitrate. Now what they do is, like as here you can see, if it forms a nitrate, here you can see nitrate and O3, nitrate is formed, the uh, nitrate is insoluble from the so that can easily be absorbed by the roots of the plants. Now they when absorbed by the roots of the plants, it is intaken by the plants. So in inside the plant, nitrate has no use. So nitrate is converted into ammonia. For so conversion of ammonia, multiple enzymes are involved. What are they? We will deal about them uh, later on. Still, nitrate are converted into ammonia. And these am ammonia are converted into amino acids and proteins. As you can see here, proteins in the plants are microbes. These proteins and amino acids are used up by the plants to convert multiple uh, reactions in their body like growth, development and all. And uh, when these proteins in the plants grow and uh, they die, these proteins and amino acids get excreted and again they decay and they again form into ammonia. Now this ammonia form can again further convert it back to nitride by nitrosomonas or, or an, and nitrosomonas to again back to nitrate by nitrobacter. Multiple organisms are involved in this case like ammo um, ammonia to nitrate, nitrosomonas, nitrite to nitrate, ammonia to nitrite, nitrite to nitrate by nitrobacter. In the same way, reverse nitrate to ammonia, by, uh, it can be easily absorbed. So, the multiple organisms which are nitrogenase enzymes are there, nit nitrate reductase, nitrite reductase enzymes are used. We talk about ease of these processes in detail later on but here we are just talking about this nitrogen cycle how a cycle takes place so in the cycle takes place as it is like nitrogen converted to nitrate nitrate converted to ammonia ammonia absorbed by the plants plants die they convert to ammonia back 
morning I'll come back to back to my tribe, night I'll come back to my tribe and I further return back to the atmosphere where they can uh, then denitrify it by denitrifying bacteria and offer come same back to nitrogen. So this is the basic mechanism of a cycle. In this way, nitrogen, if a nitrogen gets converted directly into nitrate, this is the process, but sometimes nitrogen also can convert into ammonia as shown in the figure here by industrial processes, symbiotic processes or by the help of free living organisms as well. In case of lightning, nitrogen fixed combines with the oxygen or in nitrate is found in other cases that are explained here, like in industrial fixation, symbiosis and in other by other free living organisms may convert the nitrogen directly into ammonia as well and the first process takes place. So this is a simple mechanism. We also al should always take in consideration that nitrogen, free nitrogen in the atmosphere can never be up of any use to plants or animals. First, the free living nitrogens need to be converted into the soluble form of nitrates or nitrites that can be absorbed by the plants and they convert into amino acids. The amino acids are further eaten by the animals uh, animal protein and then animal uh, convert them into animal protein and after they die they actually can be recycled back or from plants only they die and they convert back into the amino forms and the cycle takes place like this so in order to be used up by the plants or by animals this uh, this nitrogen cycle is the most um, only in the form of soluble nitrate and nitrites form they get uptaken so nitrogen cycle is a very crucial part we need to understand where and what all these organisms and all these enzymes are taking place and how they work we'll be talking about each of them in detail in this